Sempre Pedro Neves de Souza, CMTV. What's your opinion about Sporting Porto and the Portuguese referees? <laughs> yeah, I'm excited to get to know the referees. That is always a special, um, spe special position in, in football. Yeah, we will see. I think they will make their, their decisions. Um, I heard a little bit about it, but um, I always try to, to get my own impression. Um, yeah, Sporting Porto is clear. So uh, Porto, they, they got a lot of points last season, though they deserve to become champion. Um, Sporting was was second, but you know that's the past. So um, in football, you always have to look forward. Um, and now is a new season, a new chance for us to um, yeah, to to work hard and then to be ready to to fight for prizes. Uh, what is your opinion about this game? Os descontos, houve uma decisão inaceitável de errada do árbitro, o cartão vermelho para o Gonçalo, era claramente um penalti, não sei porque é que ele não foi verificar ao ecrã, hoje foi muito difícil a vitória, mas acabamos por conseguir. Hello, João Miguel Nunes, RTP. I would like you to ask you about two moments of the game. The first one uh, with the Gonçalo Ramos in uh, Vizela's area that uh, ended with the, the red card for Gonçalo. And the, the second one, the, the penalty in the last minute. I would like to know what you think about that. I think the first one was a joke. So I think uh, to don't give this penalty is for me is unacceptable. So I think it was very clear. You don't need a VAR to, to make the right decision. It was a 100% penalty in my opinion. And that he didn't check this moment um, after he gave the yellow red card for Gonzalo is for me, I cannot understand to be honest. So I think when you, when you have a VAR, so I think then you have to you have to use the VAR at the right moment. So exactly in these decisive moments of the game, you have to you have to use the VAR. If you don't use the VAR in this moment, then we don't need the VAR because it was a clear wrong decision. I think it was a clear contact. It was on purpose. He he put his body into the legs of Gonzalo. It was a 100% penalty. And to give the yellow, I think also the first yellow card was no yellow card. My, was my feeling. I haven't seen the situation again. But in the match, I think both uh, they 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 slided um, against each other. And yeah, but that made it more difficult. Um, and the second one, I think, yeah, you don't have to give the penalty 100%, but you can give the penalty. So I think the decision was 50-50.